Hello, my name's Patrick. Welcome to a brand new puzzle game of which I'm going to show all of you. <laughs> Welcome Patrick's everyone Parabox. to Patrick's Parabox. This is a wacky little game that I've been seeing uh, go around the place. I played a, I played about, I think, World 3 or so in it. Uh, and I want to uh, show everybody what the game is like. So, uh, what with that said, everyone can, see it in, everything, everyone can see it in all, all right? I uh -huh. see it. All right, with that said, let us enter the Parabox. I will say right off of that, like, something about this style is already giving me some mild uh, Thomas is Alone vibes. Or Thomas was alone. I could see that a little bit. So, uh, first off, Patrick's Pair Box is very, in in essence, it's a slide, it's a sliding puzzle game. You want to push these blocks around, make sure that all of the uh, block outlines are filled, and make sure that Patrick himself gets to the Patrick outline. Hi, Patrick. Hello. And uh, <laughs> beyond that, there's nothing too crazy just yet. Uh, over there on the left, you can see that they're showing off how if I ever make a mistake. I can always, um, I can always redo, oh, I, I can always redo a step like that. Oh my god, this looks so cute, I almost want to try this now. So, it's time to get to the part where this actually becomes a para box. So, we have a, what looks to be so far a normal block slime puzzle. But what happened, but now you notice that the block to the uh, right of this one has some weird stuff inside oh, of it, correct? Oh, I think I know How? where this is going. Yep. Oh! Oh! Oh, jeez, that's a... Uh, you know, that's definitely a slightly more varied turn than I was thinking, because this, I was thinking it was going to be more along the lines you just, like, you squeeze it from one end to the other, kind of like a straight-up uh, juice squeezer. Yeah. Oh, like it would squeeze... Nope. So basically, we are playing with levels within levels. Oh my levels. god, he even blinks! <laughs> nice. So the, so the, way, the way it works is uh, you can push a block around like normal until it comes against a wall, and at this point... Uh, if the block can no longer be pushed ahead, you will squeeze inside of it oh, and out the other end. Nice. And uh, they will become more complex, such as this guy here. So I want to move him down, then get to the side of him so I can push him from this same, from this angle. Huh. So wait, and is there again, a specific button you have to press in order to squeeze in, or is it just one of those things that happens automatically? It just happens automatically as you press into it. Oh, uh, okay. So you do I mean, need some sort of... It looks relatively simple. Oh, trust me, Sealy. Puzzle puzzle games like these can have a have a knack for very for very being very much uh, complicated the further you go on, which is definitely something I noticed when I try to uh, play. Like for example, Baba is you. That reminds oh, yeah. me. Did, no, Baba is you gets crazy. Did you guys ever do a look at the original Tetris? Uh, we did do a whole Tetris re retrospective way back when. I I want to say you were there with us for it. Was that? Okay, we, we, this was so long ago. I can't even whole... remember. That's when we did that whole chronological, like, you know, step through a lot of uh, classic uh, Tetris games. Anyway, on to World 2. Like, I remember we did the original Tetris. At some point, we did Magical Tetris Challenge, then Tetris World. It's at one of, and the last thing we started off, ended off with was um, Tetris Effect. Oh, and yeah. again, I still lament the fact that we did that look at, like, a couple weeks, let alone maybe a month or whatever, before Tetris 99 was a thing. Hmm. Yeah. When I was a kid, oh, yeah, I used I to call it, when I was a kid, I used to call it Tetris. Tetris. <laughs> oh, <that's horrible. laughs> so, uh, while I'm so while I'm charging ahead into all this stuff, uh, James, hi, buddy. Your guys' initial thoughts on the para box? I mean, sharing Seely sentiment, it definitely looks interesting, and in some mm -hmm. ways, pretty cute. Mm -hmm. There's just something. Got, work with, uh, there's just nesting. something so cute about anything with eyes and no nose or mouth. <laughs> Right, Actually, so you know what? The more I stop and think about it, um, uh, oh, oh, <laughs> all nested. That's uh, oh boy. But uh, what yeah, was and, gonna they, say? and the the red the, and the red square levels are challenge levels, which will have even more uh, complexities to them. Gotcha. Yeah, go ahead. But uh, but yeah, no. Just looking at the looking at the main character here, Patrick. Hey, Patrick. But um, I just see him, and like. If it weren't for the fact he's already red and his eyes are a little bigger, he would pretty much look like a dead giveaway for a QB. Oh, like from Bob uh, Box, Box Boy. Boy. Box Boy. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. I almost thought you were talking about the other QB that should not be mentioned. Uh, I'll not uh, say from, yes. From, from Mad uh, Madoka, Madoka Magica. Magica the, uh, the, weird, the weird, like plant, the weird, like uh, bunny-looking thing. Oh yeah, the, that thing. Oof. Yeah. 
put you in here. Whoop. Snug that guy in there. <laughs> it, oh. 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 Hang on. I can fix this. I can fix this. Uh, okay, no, I see I see what to do now. Uh, push you in there. Then sneak you back out of here. Like so. And then you're good to go. Perfect. Mm. Bob's your flipping uncle. <laughs> nice. Oh, here's another. Here, here's probably one of my favorite levels to show off how this whole recursive thing goes. So while I'm showing this off, uh, uh, what are your thoughts on it so far, hype? Not too dissimilar to what James mentioned. Like it looks pretty cute, pretty innovative, and whatnot. Um, I don't know if I have any like strong opinions aside from that. But like I said, it looks like it's doing a good job of what it's setting out to do. I feel like we va should have asked this question sooner, or maybe we oh already have. Oh my god! Is there any? <laughs> Be beyond the likes of, like, well, what you're seeing right now, or, heck, maybe some of the other puzzle games you've been forced to set through, like, is there any in particular, like, that you would consider your favorite? Oh, what the... Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. Here's, another fun, here's another fun thing. Welcome to a level within 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 a no, level. No, Megan, stop! Oh, <laughs> so, uh, we're going to we're have to do some fun stuff here, such as leaving the level this way to push it up here. Wow. Walking out of it here. To nudge it there, oh and God. now we're ready to win. <laughs> Man, so, this is this game is a literal fucking. Uh, this is a little freaking one of those really trippy looking paintings in motion. Oh yeah, like like all the like all the infinite stairs. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, that that sounds about right. Got to do right here. Uh, but yeah, no, sorry. But um, in terms of like uh, any other like puzzle games like this, you're asking about, or yeah, like if there's any that you that you really gravitate towards. Uh, I stuff like this. I like logic puzzles like this, where there is where it's less uh, where, where where you're free to experiment. Like again, being able to redo a puzzle, no matter how messed up, no matter how messed up you make it, or going even back by like step by step. I appreciate that. Yeah, that's that's, that's really that convenient. Seems. I like that. Here's your floor. And then I get off on this floor. Oh! So, uh, if you're so not paying attention, like that, that really can like. really throw you off. Yeah. Right. So, but so bits like that I like. I like the uh, how this sets itself up to uh, <laughs> tweak things. Uh, actually, I think I want to. Wait. I was gonna say, how do you I... do? Leave yep. here and then push it. Oh. Right and I won't do I won't do any of these challenge stages. I'll just focus on trying to. Oh, well, I guess I just stepped into this one accidentally. Oops. And Patrick's got the Patrick's got the look of fear in his heart of Oh, I didn't mean to do this at all. <laughs> all right, well I guess I'll I guess I'll focus on trying to do this one then while we wait. Uh, go nudge him in there. Then. But yeah, I guess I could for, uh, to reiterate my question to hype. Like, is yeah, there any sort it. of like like puzzle games that you are particularly uh, interested in? Um, I'm trying to think because it's like. The only puzzle games I can think of that I, like, really go out of my way to enjoy are stuff like Portal, um... Honestly, not sure, because, like, not for nothing, like, I appreciate what they try to do as, like, a genre, but puzzle games aren't exactly, like, a genre that I really like to go out of my way to try out. That's fair. <laughs> yeah. Alright, empty. Empty. Oh. Now... We're going to be dealing with uh, levels like this where there actually is nothing inside of them. So we have to uh, get a little more creative with moving oh. around them huh. to nudge them in otherwise impossible backwards directions. Wait, how do you also, differentiate they... between pushing it and getting inside it? Uh, ba basically, if the block is ever against a wall like this, where Patrick is squishing against something, mm -hmm. then he will just nudge into it. But if it's possible to push the block still, he will push it. Oh, gotcha! I get it. So yeah, you like, you do need to make sure that the make sure that the block you're trying to get inside is literally like wedged onto a uh, onto a uh, wall. Yep. This one looks so really like complicated. Not... I don't think I could do this. Not... One. So, so right there, it's like it, it's just about thinking about how can you how can you nudge something out of a space while still the the the, the 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 biggest trick I would say to like solving these puzzles is find a way that you could still solve the puzzles. So like right here, I, I don't know if I could do that because I still need to nudge it in a different direction. So let's try this, and then I can nudge it into itself to fill that gap, and then I fill my gap. So so long as you can. <laughs> So long as you can prevent yourself from reaching a point where it's impossible to, um, oh, oh, oh. this box is empty. Oh, yeet. All right, let's try <laughs> this again. Let's try putting you here 
And then... You know what? Yeah, actually, better idea. Push you in there. Because then I can nudge you out. And then I can move in. Gotcha. Like that. <laughs> um... So, uh, the game, so I don't, I think the game is only out on PC right now, although I would love to see this come to Switch, because I think it's, it's a very, it, it, since it's so simple, just, uh, sliding puzzles, I think that could work just fine with the Switch. I really don't doubt that this could eventually get a Switch port. I really hope so, It's pretty much become I, the, <laughs> it's pretty much become the indie machine for the past couple of years, and the, most especially puzzlers like these. Agreed. Hey guys, I'll be okay. right back. I just have a voicemail I need to listen to. I'll be back. No worries. Okay. Alright, so this time I'm gonna do this, where I'm gonna nudge all these out to begin with. There you go. Then... Oh, nope. That ain't gonna uh, work. Nope. Oh, uh, okay. Hang on. There's gotta be some way to do this. Okay, how about... Oh, I got it. Then that, and then nudge it. Gotcha. Bingo. So, it just takes a little bit of a... Trial and erroring, I will say, but, um... Beyond that, uh, have you guys tried any other source of puzzle games out lately? As of recently? Um, hmm, that's a good question. Um, nothing immediately comes to my mind aside from, like, a, those that I still play on a regular basis, like, say, maybe Puzzle Bobble or, um... Okay, I'm back. Or just the regular oh, old right. Tetris. Okay. And I just got some good news. I'll tell you guys when this is over. Alrighty. Alrighty. Phew. Good news, everyone! No, go back out there, Patrick. I just gotta remind yeah, myself man. to delete the voicemail that's on the recording. Oh yeah, oh, be sure to well, do that because that, that would help. nobody need nobody here needs to go here and that. Well, more so those that are going to be watching this don't need to go here and that. Yep. You don't yes. need to be hearing your dirty laundry. <laughs> no one needs there we go. to. That allows me to get that space in there. No one needs to know that. Uh, I was I was trying to make a funny wordplay joke, but I couldn't come up with anything. Also go, okay. also, go figure that the uh, hub world of this game would pretty much ma match the exact same tone that this game's already going for with its puzzles. Oh yeah, no, we're 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 we're, we're totally just. Uh... Ooh, this one looks fun. So what's happening here is uh, now this this whole level's entitled "Eat" because I'm basically going to be trying to uh, force. This is basically showing that hey, you can also you can still interact. With the, uh, with, you can still interact with pushing things inside of this, um, of, of, of the, of the, uh, other levels without actually having to, uh, oops, hang on. I was gonna say, don't you need three, three, three under that? Yeah, actually, yeah, oh, oh. well, it's tricky because this is, uh, this is just a five by five grid, so it'd be tricky to fit all of them while still giving room to me to be able to nudge right. it in, but if I do this... One at a time. Now I can say. Oh, three. okay. From this end. You know what this? You, you know go. what this actually kind of reminds me of? <clears throat> What's that? What's that? I'm not sure if anybody's familiar with it, but <clears throat> in Twilight Princess, there were some ice block levels that you had to push them in a certain way to get them on switches. Uh huh. Uh huh. And uh, you'd have to push the blocks a certain way to, you know, reach switches that weren't all the way on one side, they'd be in the middle of the ice field. So you have to yes. figure out, how can I push a block to land on that switch without it going all the way to the other side? Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. I look forward yeah. to us getting started on that, even if it's not anytime soon. It, it's, it's definitely still on our plan to do so. Yeah. All right. Okay. We just still got, we still got a couple more Zelda games we want to do first. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, no, I think did you ever you answer my question? Did you ever answer my question about the Oracles games? If you wanted me to finish editing those. Yeah, no. Sorry, just real quick. I'm helping Logan out. So yeah, you. Yeah, you push that. And then I, because then I'm still outside of this guy, so I can just nudge him down. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so yeah, so I mean, I, 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 I can see you get, I can see you getting kind of into this hype from the sounds of that. Well, I mean, like it's just a matter of, like. I'll be I'll be perfectly blunt. I feel like a lot of people have already picked up on this. Lord knows Matt loves to point it out often. The reason that I'm not <laughs> really too eager to do a lot of puzzle games is that I'm not particularly smart. You're not go oh, oh, relax. I'm not either, but I like puzzle games. Oh, actually, I just realized I'm dumb. I can just do this, and then you'll go boop, down boop, the train. Boop, boop, boop. There you so go. That I can get inside of it. Yay! Woo. I, I, I mean, again, like, well, the, the, okay, 
like there yes yes hype there could be pressure okay that's a wall yes there could be <laughs> pressure hype if you were trying to like if you were trying to um oh i got an idea uh push push the green lock into the uh into that uh in the bottom of that uh square or that square you can't exactly push through like that. oh i see and then i do that and then yeah that's go. why that was but there like, so it's like how to put it like if it was like a race, if you're trying to beat these puzzles as fast as you can, then yes, I get what you're. I, I see what you're saying there, where like that could become. Um, well, I don't think uh, it's necessarily a matter of like being them fast. It's just a matter of like being them. Period. <laughs> but but I mean like regardless regardless, it's not a. Uh, what the heck is this? Hmm? Oh, what, the, what is that? I am P oh, I'm P for Patrick. Hi. Okay, so he has <laughs> to get into the equal sign and then. Oh, and then the two blocks sent me in here. <laughs> That's right that, no, here. there, no, there's a surefire way to fuck with somebody. I, I couldn't do it. Jeez. This would be way too so confusing then, for me. I think I got this. Hang on. Uh, like, oh, then I can just go straight out around and boop and boop. Those wow. are special text levels that can be unlocked later. Let's learn about reference. Alrighty. Oh, Ooh. so here's uh, hmm. Okay, I can, I can still play with levels within levels, but I believe this is now the part where I need to start being careful. Because if I'm not, so if I'm if I'm not careful, I could end up into oblivion without even realizing it. <laughs> by by pushing a level like if you ever if you ever try to push a level outside of a level, then problems happen. Oh, yeah. So you gotta be very mindful of them. Uh, okay, so I need to somehow get this level inside of this block. So let's see. Uh, Okay, okay, okay. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I'm, thinking, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, Logan. Just the way your voice is, I can, I can almost hear that as a dub, like an imp improv dub. What? I'm, I'm, me, I'm trying to sound out all this stuff in my head. Yeah, I can see your voice fitting this little guy right here. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Oh, nope. Uh, hang on. Wait. Uh, leave outside to push him in here, and then oh. leave back out to that previous level to be able to go in here, and then, yep. <laughs> Get ready for your head to start hurting. I was about to say, hope you hope your brains haven't started to fry. Mine's already here, fried. Go, here, let me leave out so I can show one of those challenge levels. Mine we fried a long end. time ago. Aw, here you want to see what you want to see what Oblivion looks like. So I just pushed this level out of itself, and now nothing oh. can exist. Shit. Oh man. I don't want to be here. So let's uh, let's 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 redo that. I was, I was gonna oh, say, so... can you go back if you did that? But you just answered we my can. question, so never mind. Yep, so be very mindful. Nobody wants to be a paradox. Not even Patrick. <laughs> Sorry, Not Patrick. even Squidward's house. <gasps> <laughs> do do? That was so, so cute! And then... I don't know why, but just seeing him big and up close is so cute. Okay, let's see if I can... I'm, I want to hold on to this little guy. I want to keep him forever. Oh, okay. I think I have an idea. Mm -hmm. Nudge him here. Then... Oh, I should not have done so. Hang on. Okay, so I'm going to nudge him... I want to keep Patrick here forever. ...here in preparation. <laughs> Aw. Okay, then go over here to I'm very to flattered, right. but I'm not looking for a relationship at the moment. Not you, Patrick. The other Patrick. Mm. I'm flattered, but I'm Get pretty here, sure I'm you... married. Not, is he married? I, I assume he is. Uh, okay. I haven't kept up with the Patrick show. What? What? Yeah. what what's? Uh... No, Patrick Warburton. Patrick Warburton. Oh, I thought we were talking about that other Patrick. Like that. <laughs> there's too many yeah, Patricks. Me... A lot of Patricks, actually, more than you would think. Now there's Patrick Seitz, who's now into the mix. We got to figure out now. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, what is outside of this guy? Except okay, for Patrick Swayze, he passed, passed away. Guy. Okay. Mm. Oh, really? Patrick Stewart? No, Patrick Swayze. No, I know. I'm, I'm oh. just thinking of more Patricks. We, we we just talked about Patrick Stewart. Really? Did we? <laughs> uh, I think we I, we got ourselves stuck. <laughs> okay, so the blue one. Okay, so we need to end in the blue one. Got it. Okay, so uh, let's nudge you uh, out a little bit. Like and that. We're going to nudge you because that's where it's going to end. Then you can go back in your spot, and then you can go back in your spot, and then you can go back in your. You can go back in your spot, and then I can go in mine, and we all are we all win. <laughs> We're all okay. hunky dory. So, but again, like so, as far as this is concerned, I, I I like this like weird like brain twisty stuff going on here. 
I mean, again, it, it, it is a very interesting idea, and one that I wouldn't mind seeing uh, uh, more done with. <laughs> yeah. Also, I realize I, I messed something up. Okay, hang on. So Although, I... I will definitely say, this has sort of been lingering on my mind for the past look, for the past while now, since we started this. But, yes. like, I know it's this is a little too small to warrant such a thing, but I want to see a mod where the where the where Patrick's face is just replaced with Patrick's. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm not against it. Oh, okay, now I see what I did wrong. So I want to nudge you. I want to nudge him into the level. So let me get him in there. Get him in there, <laughs> and then just wedge it deep. Then come back out here so I can then get ready to push this guy down. Too far down. Too, too far up. There. Just right. Now then. Nudge you up there. Get you ready so I can nudge him back into his spot. And then I and go then back into And then I take my place as the king of the cosmos. <laughs> <laughs> so, but yeah, apart from that, oh, now I have to do some challenge levels. About, oh, because I completely skipped these. My bad. Whoops. But, uh, otherwise, eh, I, I apologize if this is seeming a bit, uh... How to put it? I, I apologize. If this is seeming a little bit like redundant to be doing all of this, but I, I really enjoy all this wacky stuff. I know. I, 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 I don't doubt it. Like it, it, it definitely looks like it has its own charm for those that are into this sort of stuff. Yeah. Like it feels like it has a similar level of professionalism that we got out of um, uh, Baba's You, for example. Yeah. Whoops. Not work out. That not work out as well as I thought it would. Uh, I will probably end the video after I solve this puzzle. Just. Again, I, I appreciate if ever I appreciate if, if people just like hearing my like ramblings as I try and figure out because now because now I will admit I thought it would have taken me longer to get to this point, but uh, we actually managed to start tackling puzzles I'd never seen before. So, uh, oh. <laughs> but there we go. That's it. Okay, actually there there was one more before that particular thread ends. Let's just we'll we'll, we'll, we'll wrap up we'll wrap that up as soon as I get to that. Uh, let me see. Um, if I leave outside of here. Then I can let you down, and oh, I see what I need to do. Okay. Um, <laughs> hmm. Now you see the gen. You see the general thought process behind the Lucky Jack. Yes, the intrinsic journey that begins. Okay, so if I. Okay, now I see what I'm doing wrong. Okay, now I can leave from here to go up and down, then nudge myself back out, push my level back into there, and we're done. Voila. So yeah, stuff like that I, I really like. And so this so again, if, if the if any of these puzzles really were fun to check out, then uh by all means give a look see into uh Patrick's Actually hold on, box. hold on, real quick. Let's end this end this off with actually go back to that previous position. No no the oh, previous uh, position. Put, put put Patrick in the middle. There you go. Perfect. So yeah. Thank you all so much for joining us for Patrick's para box within its own para Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Patrick and Patrick and Patrick and Patrick and Patrick and Patrick.